Before we go, I want to take a moment to thank you, our viewers. It is an incredible honor to be sitting in this chair, and I feel the huge responsibility it carries. I also want to recognize all of the women, all of the people of color who've been pathfinders to make this moment possible, as well as all of the journalists who've mentored me along the way. When my colleague Andrea Mitchell applied for her first job at a news radio station in Philadelphia in 1967, she was told the newsroom was no place for a woman. Well, she talked them into hiring her for the overnight shift. I'm here because she and other fearless women never stopped fighting for their places in the newsroom. Now, all five Sunday shows are moderated or co-moderated by women. So to Martha, Margaret, Dana, and Shannon, I am incredibly honored to join you on Sunday mornings. I also stand on the shoulders of the first moderator and co-founder of this broadcast, Martha Roundtree, who had the courage to launch this program back in 1947. Here's what she had to say accepting a Peabody Award on the mission of Meet the Press. As long as the press of America is free, America will be free. And what we have tried to do is to bring the press conference, the heart of our free press, to the whole nation. Let us never forget that information belongs to the American people. And it is that information which Meet the Press has been trying to bring each week in the homes of the American people. An informed public means a strong republic, and Meet the Press is dedicated to that cause. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.